Hey everybody, I'm back y'all with another video. So let's see what's going on. Let's see how the masculine is feeling about the divine feminine. What message does he have for the divine feminine? If you're new to the channel, welcome. I am the Empress. If you are returning, welcome back, guys. Thank you, everybody, for your love and support. Everybody who has been liking and commenting. I read all of y'all comments. Everybody who shares the video, thank y'all so much for your love and support. Everybody who has shopped with me on the website at EmpressEmpireOils.com. Everybody who has booked a personal reading with me, thank y'all so much. I have been showing so much love. Okay, so let's jump into it because we got some jumpers. So let's jump into it. Okay, I'm hearing you do know. You do know that you have free will, right? Okay, so this masculine is saying to the divine feminine, okay, that he has free will. Okay, so he's saying, look, do what you want. I'm going to do what I want. I'm getting that energy. You do recognize that we have free will. I feel like this masculine is grieving also, but he's wearing a mask. So, I feel like this is his energy. He's trying to portray that he has free will, that he does what he wants. He wants you to see that. He wants you to recognize that. Um, but the whole time, he's really in grief, okay? But he's wearing a mask. Now, we got devotion family. So, he could be, you know, very devoted to his family, putting a lot of time into his family. Or he has created another family here with someone else. And this is where he's devoting his time. But really the whole time he's in grief. But he's wearing a mask because I see him at a crossroad. Okay. So it seems like to me like he's trying to prove a point. Okay. It's like he's trying to prove some type of point. Like, you know, look, you know I got free will. I can do what I want. You don't own me type of vibe. That's what I'm getting. I feel like um, we got very soon keeps popping up. Yeah, passion and very soon. Like this person wants to, they want to get in bed with you. <laughs> I feel like they're going to have the confidence to try to come towards you. All right, so let's see what else. Let your friends help you. Okay, so yeah, like I said, keep an open mind. So there are some red flags that this person, yeah, look at this, reconciliation. This masculine is throwing out hints, okay? Some way, shape, or form, this masculine is throwing out or is getting ready to throw out some type of hints that they want to reconcile. They're going to be reaching out to your friends or using their friends to try to get you to be open to letting them come back okay yep i see y'all are in the separation and y'all could be in separation but somebody here this masculine could be working on his finances right now okay so this is the reason why he had to release okay so he's working on his finances but he's throwing some signs okay he's throwing some signs some type of red flag or like look over here pay attention to this to try to get your attention okay let's see let's see what else what does this masculine want to say to the mind feminine Three of Swords. I feel like some of y'all have evolved big time. And this person is over here having regrets because I feel like they're dealing with a third party. They wanted to go back and forth between you and this third party. They wanted it to, they wanted to have their cake and eat it too. But I'm hearing they made a choice. They had to make a choice. They had to make a choice, okay? So, somebody made this person make a choice, okay? So, maybe they chose to deal with the third party, okay? But the thing of it is, is I don't feel like this person over here 
happy about the choice. Three of Wands. And I told you, they're watching the hell out of you. I'm hearing, I just want to, I did that because I want to see what you was going to do. Okay, so this person, that's the excuse that they're giving. Like, yeah, I just, I said that because I wanted to see what you was going to do. I did that because I wanted to see what you was going to do. Don't fall for that. They did exactly what they want to, want to do. Because at the beginning of the read, it said free will. Okay, so they just want to make it known that they got free will and they can do what they want. So this is something that they wanted to do. So don't fall for it. I'm hearing this is how I'm going to start the conversation off. Okay, for some of you, there's a marriage involved. Someone could be married. Or this person wants to split finances with you. Like, oh, I'm hearing 50-50. They understand that they took things too far. I'm hearing feel like things got took too far. Okay, Seven of Swords and the Fool. This is definitely somebody taking something to the extreme, to the max. Okay, and then with that Eight of Wands, that's some distance. Okay, so... I'm hearing they took things too far. They know that they did. Okay. They know that they took things too far. Knight of Pentacles could be a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. But this person wanted to give you something to think about. Okay. So they're trying to, I'm seeing giving you space. They're in, they're in some worry, some energy because they feel like the relationship is, would be forced like, they, they feel like the relationship is forced. Like, they're forcing. They don't want to force a relationship on you. I feel like this person feel like you were dealing with a third party as well. Could be a Sagittarius involved. All right. But I see this person. Uh, there we go. Forced relationship. Okay. They, listen, somebody, a third party forced them into some type of connection. Okay, a third party forced them into a connection. Seven of Wands and Two of Cups. This is definitely a forced connection. Like, it was forced. Tell me more about this Three of Swords, then. Five of Swords, out of spite. Out of spite and out of anger. So, they're dealing with this third party out of spite and out of anger. They're not happy. They're not fulfilled. This isn't really where they want to be at. They're forcing it. You look at this person as a liar and the devil. <laughs> you already know it's time. You know this person is manipulative. And this person does want to reach out to you. And Ace of Cups. Yep. They still have feelings there. Feelings are still there. Ten of Pentacles. Yep. I'm here and not going to fall for it this time. They feel like you're not going to fall for it this time. They sure that you're not going to fall for it this time. They feel that. So that's what I got, guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in that comment section below. Continue to like the video. Continue to share, guys. That's a great way to energetically give this channel some love. As well as book a personal reading with me, guys. My email address, I'll put that in the description box below. As well as if you want to shop online on my website, guys. It's www.EmpressEmpireOils.com. All right. And I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.